I think we will see a lot of innovation and I think we will see a lot of innovation also in Europe because it's not a question of whether we need these solutions. The question is, should they be produced in Europe and by that the jobs be produced in Europe or should we give these markets to the Chinese and the Brazilians and what have we. And right now in Europe where there is such a big emphasis on, wow, where do we create the jobs of the future? It is a fact that one of the most crisis resilient sectors during this crisis that was those sectors who delivered green solutions they did create more jobs they did not all in all reduce the number of jobs how many sectors can say that so i think that more and more people understand this is not just about climate this is not about energy it's about macroeconomics it's about what do we live from in the future where do we create the jobs in a world where still more people want still more food, still more energy, still more water. It goes without saying that those who can deliver the smartest solutions, the most efficient solutions, they are also best suited at the world market to get most of the orders. I think that there is a growing understanding that we can talk all as much as we want about development, poverty eradication, but if you are not serious about the climate and environment impact and the climate and environment challenges, then you are going to make some stupid investments. I think that, that things are interacting, the sustainability, sort of the, the, the social development, the economic development and the growth uh, and uh, the environment and the climate agenda, that these must be seen as one.